Here's the thing. We could really use your help with this ongoing case. We've been getting a lot of missing persons reports recently. Nobody ever saw those people assaulted or anything. They just vanished. Some of those people are even resonators, or they've served in the military. Since you're always coming and going from the city, can you help me watch out for anything weird or suspicious? Thank you so much. No, I could count on you. Ring me up when you spot anything sus, yeah? <laughs> Laters. The Seance Society. I never heard of them before. They said they have a solution, but how? This is very suspicious. No matter how I look at it, guess I'll just go and see for myself. Guess I'll just go and see for. Oh, so you've accepted my invitation, Rover. Well, yes. My name is Laron. Since you were here, you must have lost someone too. Daddy? Now, Yuan Yuan, no need to be afraid. He's not one of those evil patrollers. You're safe with me. Yes, my daughter. Her name is Yuan Yuan, my only precious. And Daddy is precious? Absolutely, my dear. We will stay together. Nothing can take you from me again. Ah, uh, yes. Once we were separated by an unfortunate turn of events. But now I have her back, thanks to the Seon Society's help. Truly a miracle, is it not? And you, yes, you too can be reunited with your loved ones. Just come join us. No, she didn't. She was never gone. Can't you see? Yuan Yuan, she... She's still alive. Alive and well. Daddy, what's happening? You're scaring me. He seems off. Is he overclocking? No, no doctor. I don't need anything. I am not leaving her. You're not leaving daddy, right? Yuan Yuan? I... You on, you on! Shut up! Take your hands off her now! No! Daddy! That's enough, Lorong. <sighs> She'll be safe in my care. You still have other things to do, remember? <sighs> Uh, no, don't! Yuan Yuan! Larong, do you want to lose your daughter again? Uh, no, I... Fine, I'll leave it to you. Now hand over the girl. You see, that man is her father. Why do you want to separate them? Oh, well, whatever. Wen Wen, come over here, please. Yes. Good girl. Stay here, Wen Wen. And why would you be concerned? Smart girls know how to mind their own business. Oh, you're quite the fighter. Hmm. How about... They're coming. 
coming. It's the patrollers. We can't let them find out about Wan Wan. Now, if you don't want to get into trouble, better do as I say. I'll explain everything later, including what's happening with the Seance Society. Smart choice. Good. Now come give me a hand. We'll need to hide the traces of fighting here. Everything's back to where they were before. Found a piece of paper inside one of the boxes. This seems like a transaction record. Date of transaction. It says today. Items. Four reincarnation puppets. What are those? Signy. They're wrong. Probably forgot to take it with him. That should do the trick. No signs of injuries on you on you on. That woman wasn't controlling her through resonance abilities either. Then why is Yuan Yuan obeying her commands? This should be good enough to get past their eyes. The patrollers are almost here. Shh. You there. We heard some commotion coming from this area. What's going on? Nothing, officer. We were just hanging out. Really? Then what was that loud banging and shouting? Oh, this girl just tripped over. Poor thing nearly cried her eyes out. I'm sure it's just a misunderstanding. Is that so? Then what did you do after that? It seems she can't find her father. We were just trying to help. Right, Rover? I see. So they're just being kind. I don't have other questions. You can... Leave the girl to us. We'll help find her father. Thanks, but we've got this. Little one seems quite shy. She's just warming up to us. Wouldn't want to bother you further. Don't worry. You're not bothering us. It's our job to help civilians in need. Trust me, I understand how tedious a patroller's job can get. That's why I want to help. My name's Yinglin. I'm also a patroller. Here's my ID. Oh, a fellow patrol. You sure this is real? Never seen- You think I can't tell a fake ID when I see it? Shut your mouth. No reason you would have seen me. I don't work here. Just visiting Jinjo on vacation. Ah, makes sense. Then we'll leave the girl to you. Thank you. If you can't find her dad, bring her to the patroller station. Come on, we're going, rookie. Enjoy your day. Have fun in Jinjo. Oh, hey, uh, wait up, Captain. Hmm. Do I not look the part? I didn't plan to blow my cover, but that patroller was sharp. I would have risked them finding out about Wan Wan otherwise. You should see for yourself. Let your soul rest. Return to your true form, daughter of Larong, Wen Wen. Yes, a puppet to be exact. This helpless little girl before you, Larong's beloved daughter, is nothing but a humanoid robot. and the so-called Seon Society. They're the ones behind Jinjo's recent missing person cases. They offer these puppets to people who have lost their loved ones. These puppets can perfectly replicate the personalities of the deceased. To those mourning people, they're indistinguishable from the living. Yes, 
With the puppet, she has been resurrected by her father's longing. People gave up everything to join this society for one chance to reunite with their beloved. As for how they got their hands on these puppets, I have no idea yet. Beware. The puppets may seem harmless, but those who got too attached are much more likely to overclock. Lorong's the recruiter. You're the perfect outsider, traveling all alone, ripe for the taking. <laughs> but it seems he picked the worst candidate possible. I need to apprehend the true culprit behind this group, but this is not your problem. I'm on a mission. Leave now and forget everything that happened here today, will you? Lorong's transaction record. Where did you find it? <sighs> You're such a box of surprises. Sure, why not? I'll give you what you want, but I don't want prying eyes. If you're really that curious, meet me outside the city at these coordinates. We meet again, as I expected. This place seems safe enough. So, any questions for me? <laughs> Didn't know you cared so much about me. This is supposed to be confidential, but I've been authorized to make my own calls. My orders were clear. Infiltrate the Seance Society, gather evidence of their crimes, and find the culprit behind it all. So far, I've had no luck meeting any of their higher-ups. Just playing a system for Lorong to gain their trust. So, any questions for me? They operate under the guise of a non-profit charity. The Seance Society lures people in with their promise of bringing back their loved ones. But it's all a sham. You've seen firsthand the truth behind their supposed resurrection. Despite previously keeping a low profile, they've recently become more active and are using people like Lorong to recruit new victims. From what I've gathered, they're in cahoots with Fraxidus. And a Fraxidus intervention would have only made things worse. So, any questions for me? Lorong, once a Midnight Ranger, lost his daughter in it. He joined the society to see his daughter again, and he's been feverishly trying to convince others to do the same. He truly believes the puppets are living miracles, a godsend means of redemption. He could have been a good father, but his obsession with losing his daughter consumed him. So, any questions for me? Aside from recruiting new people in Jinzhou, Lorong and I were given another task. See the transaction record in your hands? Some Fraxidus members ordered a batch of puppets from the society. We're in charge of handling the deal. Not until their collaboration started. The Fraxidus had been demanding prototype puppets regularly. I plan to investigate these prototype puppets for manufacturer clues. But Lorong keeps things very tight. He never takes me to his storage place. It's almost time for the deal. I need to bring Wen Wen back to Lorong before he gets suspicious. 
With the Fraxidus in play, things could go south very f Now you know the nitty-gritty details. It's still not too late to call it quits. You don't seem to be mourning someone. Why the interest? You've suffered a memory loss. I see. Indeed, if they can make such lifelike puppets by tapping into people's memories, perhaps they could help you remember, too. But we need to find them first. You can be my civilian investigator. What do you say? Larong and I are about to meet the Fraxidus for our deal. He will then leave to get the puppets at the storage house. I will need you to follow him and send me the coordinates once you're there. And you're in already. Didn't even think twice. Oh, well, you seem really confident. And that's a good thing. They're coming. You'll hide and watch Larong. I'll bring Wen Wen to him. Hopefully he won't suspect. Rise and shine, Wen Wen. Miss Yunlin, wh where am I? Where's Daddy? Don't worry, Wen Wen. I'm taking you to Daddy in just a moment. But before we do, promise me you'll be a good girl, okay? Okay, I promise. That's my girl. Let's go. I'm leaving the rest to you, Rover. Larong, here's your daughter, as I promised. Yuan Yuan! I was so afraid. I can't bear to lose you again. Please don't cry, Daddy. Was I being bad? No. You're always a good girl. Always. Ah, enough with the make-believe. That's a puppet! No, you're not. Yuan Yuan, I... Wen Wen's ten times more human than you people. You call that thing human? <laughs> That's just a robot lab rat. <laughs> Enough. We don't have time for this. Where's our stuff? Bring them out. Larong, go bring them the prototype puppets. <laughs> I... Hey, we ain't gone all day. Hurry up. No! I won't let you have them! We'll make you regret this. After him! You're going nowhere either, Missy. Here we go. Larong's trying to escape with the puppets. Here's hoping that Rover can stop him in time.
Daddy. I'm tired. It's okay, Yuan Yuan. They won't find us here. Those scary people. Are they coming after me? Not just you, Yuan Yuan. They want all the puppets here. But I won't let them. I'll make sure every puppet finds home. Together with people who love and need them. I will not let those freaks use them for experiments. Master Dollmaker, how could you be the first to betray our belief? Dollmaker? Is that the leader of the Seance Society? Is Master Dollmaker bad, Daddy? I... I'm not sure anymore. He was our hope. He saved us all, but... <laughs> Doesn't matter now. I must get you all to safety first. I guess they still have some morals. There's still things they won't do. I spotted them! Over there! You can't hide from this good old sniffer of mine. You on, you on? Get behind Daddy, quick. I'll grab these puppets now. What about that guy, boss? Ice him. We'll take that puppet behind him, too. Huh? I will not. The wrong's going to severely overclock at this rate. Hey! What the hell are you doing here? One man's not gonna make a difference. Get rid of them now. Forgetting someone, are we? What the? Those idiots! They were supposed to take care of you! Careful! Sorry I knocked out your friends earlier. We're not planning to start anything with the Fraxidus, really. What do you say? Care to give Lurong and his daughter a little break? You may have these puppets here. We can pretend none of this ever happened. You think we're stupid or what? Oh, you sure you want to do this? We're business partners, remember? Partners? You're just a bunch of lab rat keepers. So they're not up for peace talks. What do you say, Rover? <laughs> True. You know your Fraxidus well. You've got some moves. Impressive. Guess I can rely on you a bit more. I'll be counting on you. How did you like the fight? Are you injured? Yeah, better stay cautious. I've seen too many die from recklessness. We took care of him for now. My, my, are you worried about me? What a surprise. I thought you never trusted me this entire time. Fine, I'll spare you the teasing for now. Your serious face is quite cute though. Don't worry, we took care of all the Fraxidus people here. If the society becomes suspicious, I'll just pin everything on them. They may still question me, but I've mastered gaining trust with lies. It's the key to being an undercover investigator, just like what I did to you. Try feeling your back, a bug and a tracker. How else do you think I got here so quickly? I put it there the first time we met. Don't trust anyone. That's the first thing I learned in training. You may not belong to any group, but you seem to care for Lerong and Yuan Yuan, and you want to recover lost memories. I can't risk you betraying me by helping them run off or selling me out. Better safe than sorry. Of course, Dollmaker. He must be a big deal in the Seance Society, or even their leader. We're getting close to the truth, but we have another issue at hand. I did a quick checkup on Lerong. He just passed out from overclocking. Lucky for him, it wasn't that bad. Yuan Yuan returned to her puppet form once Lerong fell unconscious. 
Not even. I doubt she'll be reactivated anytime soon. We've reached a dead end with Larong. Yeah, I was planning to. We may find some clues, but we gotta move first. Can't stay here for long. Go collect the puppets. I'll look after Larong and Yuan Yuan. Acknowledged. Is that our only option? But I believe it's unnecessary. <sighs> yes, understood. I'll have it taken care of. Yes, it's my contact from the Public Security Bureau. They'll be sending people over soon. We can leave Lurong and Yuan Yuan in their care. Are you done with the puppets? That's fine. We'll dig further once we're in a safer location. My contact informed me of a safe house not far from here. The patrollers will meet us there. We'll have a designated meetup spot. There will be wolf-shaped markings nearby to show- Let's move. Can't let the Fraxidus find us. No more markings in sight. This must be the safe house. Look, there's a device on that wall. Hmm. We need a passcode. They were thorough. The safe house is hidden and has a passcode. There should be some hints nearby. Let's look around.
Thank you. 